to support the construction of this country's international airport of Akai. This came about following Prime Minister Dr. Wilson's last trip to New York, where he attended the United General Assembly's 67th meeting. At the news conference at Cabinet Room on Monday, Dr. Gonzalez mentioned he held his talking with a number of officials and other countries that could be assuring they are willing to help in the construction of the airport. In the coalition of the willing in support of the Argyle International Airport was also a priority for us in our discussions. The representatives of the United Arab Emirates, Kuwait, Kazakhstan, Iran, Georgia, Bahrain, and Azerbaijan all express a strong interest in providing new or additional assistance in the completion of the airport. I say I want this meeting primarily to discuss. Let's get this one out of the way, then we will talk about it. Because I'm in this business a lot. If eight people inside it to talk, I talk about this. Eight other people talk about other things. This important thing get diluted. <laughs> but I, I too long to fall for that kind of thing. So we took on this subject and then when we had received certain assurances that uh, they look at we will talk about some other things now And everybody knows that I've been in since I became Prime Minister that people must not apply status because this thing is out of order. They're bogus and sooner rather than later Canada would impose visas. Louis Straker, Sir Louis spoke about it, Dr. Slater spoke about it. Burns Bonnady spoke about it. But now, they want to blame me for it.